<laughs> I remember the days where every day something happened. It was a long time ago, <laughs> before I made the training. Every day something was so dramatic. I had to deal with, I had certain thoughts and emotions that I couldn't go out of, couldn't run away from. So I had to just change the experience, change the situation, trying to find a solution. Everything appeared as a problem. <coughs> now, looking how far I have come, it's just uh, amazing seeing the difference how my life's just changed so much since relying on open intelligence and getting to know the training. From thinking that I already know everything, I came to the training, didn't want to change anything about myself because my life was quite happy. I had a positive mind, not so many negative thoughts and emotions. So I was just quite open to listen and I said, okay, great, short moment sounds cool, I will try it. But I was sure I just know that already. But then, <laughs> all the negative uh, thoughts and emotions started to come, all the status terms. And that was such a, a perfect opportunity for me to practice, to, to see what they were speaking about, seeing that in my own experience. And I started to listen more deeply. <laughs> and taking these short moments of open intelligence because it, something about it just struck my heart and so directly. I had, there is nothing about you you need to change. You can allow everything to be as it is and I love that so much. I just love that, love to hear that. So of course there are all kinds of thoughts that came up like how, what does it mean not to change that I'm negative? I'm thinking something bad about that person. I'm not compassionate enough. I'm not open. I feel hate. I feel fear. I feel lonely. What does it mean it's perfect? I don't need to change it. I disagreed. <laughs> I, I couldn't see that as perfection. So that's why I wanted to test it to see. So coming to open meetings, that was six years ago in Rishikesh. And getting to know the training and listening to the instructions that maybe many times I couldn't understand as well as English, I couldn't understand so well. But again, the, just the space, the safe space to be as I am was very powerful. I know probably for sure you noticed that too, just to be here as you are. No one is expecting anything. We are not running away when you ask certain questions. The, the, the fearlessness just to be, to be completely beingness, being as we are. So that's how I gain confidence in open intelligence and every day more, every moment more confidence. Assurance, from the first day, assurance. From the first short moment, something was just different, open. And I wanted to test more and I, I'm still here <laughs> and I'm still taking short moments and relying on the four mainstays. So I did, the, of course, the introductory training and the 12 empowerments and the 12 empowerments was such a powerful training for me because then I couldn't anymore avoid my data streams. I could see with the support of the trainers and the group everything clearly about myself. I was willing to face everything and avoid nothing and wanted deeply to harmonize the relationship in my life. Seeing that, first of all, with the, sh the power of short moments that I'm not trying to replace it anymore to, to positive thinking or to try to meditate away or keeping quiet or trying to be empty in my mind. I just, saw, I just saw that short moment so easeful, I can just be naturally as I am. You know, like now, we, we have all kinds of thoughts and emotions, but short moments of open intelligence, hey, we can leave it as it is. Hey, we can leave it as it is. It's like, oh, nothing happened, we can just move on. A carefree way of being, nothing happened. A spontaneous liveliness of every moment as it is. That's what I love so much about the training, the simplicity, the open-heartedness of everyone. 
when I come here. I meet everyone. They meet me with such openness and care and indestructible assurance that everyone is taking responsibility for their data systems. No one is a victim. So you saw that quite well. We choose. We choose to be negative or not. We choose to be a victim of the data or not. We, we may have all kinds of thoughts and emotions right now, but then we choose. We choose to emphasize the data streams, to believe they have independent nature, or we allow them to be as they are, in complete relaxation, in one short moment of open intelligence. It's like the, the daylight sun outshining all the stars, in, in daytime. The stars are still here, right? But we, can, we can't see them. We can't see the stars. We can't see. Everything is just vast, open, seamless sky, but the stars are still there. That it is like a short moment of open intelligence where everything is still there, but it's unnoticed. It's unnoticed. And we can rely on open intelligence to be of benefit to all. So we have all kinds of data streams, but regardless, we are of great benefit to all. We can use our speech beneficially, our mind in a beneficial way, our body benefit. That's the power of short moments. If we think it's so simple, and it is, but it's not too simple. It has a profound power. Don't underestimate the power of short moments of open intelligence. Mm -hmm. Even if you hear that, if you had it so many years, test it anew. Test it from the beginning. See how you can uh, empower your mind with open intelligence. Empower everyday activities, everyday relationships. Definitely what I see in myself, the assurance never stop anywhere still going more and more. The relationship with the trainer, the community, the training, the, the text, the text just to hear the video today, the text are strictly for the benefit of all and it is like that. Try to come to a training, the one day training every Saturday, just read the text and it's something that evokes open intelligence, the mind is opening up. You understand completely, even if it's not your language. You understand completely, instinctively, the power of open intelligence within you. So from the first day, I felt immediately included. I could participate in that, take part. Not anymore waiting for someone confirmation to be powerful or to have a certain state of no thoughts or no emotions or a bliss, blissful life. I wanted something so real and practical and direct. So short moments were the best to hear for me. And then, since then, I never stopped. You know, just, just being involved and, and participating and feeling more and more relaxed and, and more open. That's the benefits I see in my life powerful, open, clear, stable. And it, it, it you know, the, the data systems can be just the opposite. I'm not powerful, I'm not stable. I have lots of negative thoughts. But the assurance is completely the opposite. Powerful, always positive, always stable, always open-hearted. So check in your own experience what you see, what is completely reliable, what is unstoppable in the flow of data systems. See what is always there. So stop thinking for a moment and what remains. It's a powerful introduction. What remains when you stop thinking? What remains? Okay. Powerful open intelligence. The power to know. The power to know the next thought, emotion, sensation. So all of that as well, inseparable from open intelligence. You see like the color blue in the sky, completely inseparable, that's, that's our mind. 
That's, that's our mind, completely open, vast, expansive, and powerful. We feel everything so deeply, for everyone. Now, having expectations with relationships, first, allow other people to be as they are. It was helpful for me, allow, allowing ourselves to be as we are, we understand completely what it means to have data of anger, of hatred, of fear, of loneliness. We're not trying to change it anymore. We allow that to be in ourselves. All the negative emotions that we tried so much to run away from, not to have any, get rid of, using antidotes, replacing, indulging, gossiping about, speaking about. Try not to do it anymore. Relax for a short moment. Complete empowerment. And then rest deeply. Rest deeply. And powerfully. See that nothing about you needs to change. Once you realize that instinctively in yourself, coming here every day, you just rest more and more deeply. Just like coming here, there is no way to change it or replace it because this space is so powerful, so safe to feel everything. And then so one, once you have that with you in a short moment of open intelligence, even for a brief moment, you understand how you can allow others to have this data too. You're not afraid from people's data. People can say all kinds of things, but you're unafraid. You, you listen openly. You can see that you could have the same data and act in the same way. So, in that way, you just welcome everyone. You're not a victim of everyone. You're not compromising with people's action. You're not putting yourself down or in situations that are harmful for you. But with relying on open intelligence and allowing everyone to be as they are, you know exactly what to say and what to do in each situation. And and how to be of benefit. <coughs> yeah, that's the main thing. I always speak about being of benefit because if you look at my talks, being of benefit, being of benefit, and every talk here actually, because this context is so, it was missing to me. I, d I couldn't hear that before in other practices or training. Benefit of all as the main purpose. The benefit of all in everything, in every action, not in some places or with specific people who has great energies with everyone. So I, I, I really wanted to accommodate everything in my life. My family, my own, my own family, my husband, my, my friends, and people I don't, I don't know or I don't like, strangers. And now I feel like I can, I can just speak with anyone. And it's a great joy you know, to go to every place and to feel at home to feel at home. And even if it's challenging, even if there are afflictive states, then I know where to go. So I, I have the tools. It's not that I'm lost and, and I'm looking for someone to save me or the specific friend that usually understand me has similar data as mine and he will feel the same in the same way and probably it will help in some ways. But now I have my trainer. So I can, I can just, for example, an intimate relationship. I usually use your, your partner as a trash bin. You say everything to them, what you feel exactly, what they've done to you, how you want them to change. So that's not happening anymore in my life. I take responsibility. Uh, negative thoughts appear, but I rely on open intelligence. I choose to be negative or not with the tools I have. Then I go to my trainer and I share exactly my data systems. Then I have such a space to enjoy with my partner. I see him as he is, I allow him to be. And then also with my family, the same. Expectations can come up, but it doesn't matter. We allow expectations to be as they are. For, for, so for some of us it would sound like, oh, we don't do anything. and. Test it in your own experience and you see that, yes, you don't do anything. <laughs> you don't do anything, but everything is just so great, so easy, 
so fun. And then you develop skillful means of relationship. But skillful means that's rooted in the benefit of all. That comes from the heart directly. Um, loving more, caring more, more open. Natural, natural. Like not coming with some kind of weird technique, speaking with someone or doing something. <coughs> In a natural way. How fun is to be natural? Just yeah, everything about us. The body is relaxing. The mind with its amazing relaxation. Not trying to show off in any way. And even if we are showing off, we take a short moment and relax deeply. Like everything about us, just getting to know that about ourselves, open intelligence. Amazing, amazing. It's, there is more air to breathe. There is more life to share. There is more energy, vitality. We see only solutions. We are not anymore focusing on problems what to change, what to say to that person, how can we not feel that, feel this. We are just entirely open and responsive. You see, and all this energy that we used collapsing into our data streams, now we use it for the benefit of all. Moving on, without making any point. So resting with all descriptions about short moments too about open intelligence too, resting with all descriptions, all stories. <laughs>